Cowpeas are one of the most important food legumes in the semi-arid tropics across the world. Its protein-rich grains are consumed by rural and urban households alike and provide income when sold raw or processed into various products. Cowpea husks and fodder are also a source of protein for animals. They're easily stored and sold during the dry season for additional cash. Cowpea, soybean and groundnut act as trap crops. Trap crops stimulate the germination of the parasitic weed, Striger. But unlike cereal crops, they do not let Striger attach to their roots, so the Striger sprouts die. Cereal crops also benefit from being grown in rotation or intercropped with cowpea. As the cowpea improves soil fertility, by fixing nitrogen from the air. To practice crop rotation or intercrop your maize, millet or sorghum with a legume crop, you need good seed. Dry your cowpea seeds in the hot midday sun for four hours to maintain their viability during storage and kill adult beetles and most of their larvae. Always put your container with seed off the ground as the cold floor will affect the seed's germination power. Regularly bringing your container out in the hot sun helps to keep your seed alive. Beware of the hidden enemy Cowpea seed beetles spend most of their life as larvae hidden inside the grains on which they feed. Use airtight storage containers such as triple bags to suffocate adult beetles. Mix the seed with equal quantities of sieved sand or ash to expel air from between the seeds and to entrap any beetles emerging from them. Adding chili powder or dried plants with a pungent smell can repel and sometimes kill the beetles in storage. So remember, good storage will prevent large losses and give you healthy seeds. Growing cowpeas will help improve your soil fertility and will reduce striga if it's present in your soil. <laughs>